Maybe that should just be the type of thing I like is birds that sit in ponds. In today's video, I am so excited because I am unboxing something that I got from Northern Reflections. Okay, first off, you know how much I love Northern Reflections. I can't stop talking about it. Clearly, I made a TikTok about a month ago talking about how much I love Northern Reflections, right? They saw that and they reached out and they asked if I wanted some things and I immediately said yes. Because if there's one brand that I want to be a spokesperson, person for, it's Northern Reflections. They're my favorite brand and mostly when I'm hunting for Northern Reflections, it's usually thrifting. Anytime I'm in a thrift store, if I see that Northern Reflections label, especially if it has the loons on it, I will buy it. Northern Reflections in the last few years have had some few things that I've had my eye on, such as this sweater. When I found out that they had brought these sweaters back, I'm like, why don't I already own one? Because I have been avidly hunting in thrift stores for Northern Reflection things, especially like, like these types of sweaters. And when I found out that I could just go to the store and buy it new? I said yes. Anywho, they uh, they reached out and they asked me if I wanted a few things. I haven't opened the box yet. I literally got the box in, came back up here and set up to, to film this because I want my genuine reaction of me unboxing things. This brand was also my Oma's brand. Like I just remember her wearing Northern Reflections sweaters like all the time. And that's probably what made me love them so much. Anyways, let's, let's open it up. First off, what's that? What's that? Is that is that the orange version of the sweater I am currently wearing? Yes, it is. So let's open this bad boy up. First off, the packaging. We hope this package makes your day. It definitely has. It's made my entire month, my entire year. Pretty much like the fact that Northern Reflections wants to send me things, that to me is like the best thing ever. First off, here, here's the thing, when I went into the store to buy this one, I ended up buying this one and I ended up buying a gray version of it. Like, a, like it's gray, it's different, but it, it still has the loon on it. And I was really debating whether or not I wanted this one or I wanted this one. I, I couldn't decide. I'm like, you know what? I'm just gonna go with the purple. Eventually I will go back and buy the orange. Now I have the orange one. This is exactly what I want. Like it's orange, it's Northern Reflections. There's the loon on it. It's perfect. This is how it fits. Also, this is my first time trying all of them on. So these are my genuine reactions on how they fit me. First off, I knew this one was going to fit me like this because I have the purple one. The purple one is also a size medium. So I knew right off the bat that this one was going to fit me. Look at how bright orange this is. It's so cute. Now this one here is super, super cozy. I really like it. And for a medium, it fits really nice because you know me, I like to like get a little bit oversized. So it's bit more comfortable and this one I really like how it fits in a medium. Now I do want to show you another one I have. This one I bought when I bought the purple one. This one here which is also classic Northern Reflections. I bought this one in a large because I just like how this fits me in the large whereas this one I like how it fits me in the medium. You know because when I went to the store to buy this one I did try the medium one on and I'm like it's okay but I didn't like how the shoulders sat. I don't know something about it. So this one if you are interested in you know, purchasing these. I went up a size in this for a large and then this is the medium and I really like how comfortable this is. I did try the large in this and I think it was just a little bit, not even too oversized. It would have worked as well, but I just, I don't know, I really like the fit of this orange one and it's super soft, super nice. It has the loon on it. You know, I'm a sucker for a loon or any bird that swims in a pond. <laughs> if you know, you know. I really love how soft this is. This is sitting on top of the next one, but I have to show you a little loon brooch. Oh my goodness. You know how much I'm obsessed with ducks and birds. I mean, if you watch my last few videos, I mean like my sister made me this little duck for my birthday. That's how much I love ducks and loons and like birds that sit in ponds. Maybe that should just be the type of thing I like is birds that sit in ponds. I think that's that's a good description of the type of birds I like. But anyways, look at this cute little brooch. So adorable. It's so cute. Okay, this next one, here's the thing. I wanted it. I wanted this shirt. But unfortunately, when I went to go and purchase the shirt, it was already sold out. Like this shirt sold out in minutes and now it's in this box. It's the Spice Mice 
shirt and it's cropped. I, I love cropped shirts, especially because I can just tuck them into my pants and like there's not going to be so much material in the pants. Anyways, I am so happy that it's in this gray color because white t-shirts don't do well with me. I am not great with white t-shirts because I, I don't know, I just have this irrational fear that I'll get pasta sauce on it. You know, I don't wear nice things when I eat pasta, but like in the back of my head, I'm like, I'm going to get pasta sauce on this. So the fact that it is gray is amazing. I also got it in an extra large because I love the oversized tee and because it is a woman's brand, well, tailored more for women. I feel like the large or medium size one would have been a little bit too form fitting and I wouldn't have been very comfortable in it. It does say Northern Getaway on the tag. Does anyone else remember Northern Getaway? It was like children's version of Northern Reflections. Now they just have to bring the Cat Street Boys back. Now they have to bring that one and I will buy that one. Spice Girls, although I didn't listen to them religiously as a kid, they were everywhere as I like growing up. So when I think of Spice Girls, I think of my childhood. This is how it fits. I'm gonna be honest, I don't think I've ever bought and thrifted, gotten a t-shirt from Northern Reflections before or usually it's their long sleeve mock necks, their cardigans, or their sweaters, but I've never bought a t-shirt, so I wasn't too sure with the sizing. I feel like I probably could have went with a size large, even a medium, because I didn't realize it was gonna be cropped. And I feel like with a cropped shirt, because it's not long, it's not like form-fitting. And when it comes to like women's shirts that are form-fitted, I just don't really care for how they fit. But also, I think the neckline is a little bit big for me, so I think a large would have worked. But also, I have to say that the material of this is so soft it's not clingy at all it's not clean like that like like it's not it fits really comfortably I don't even know what to compare it to it's kind of like an oversized tee fit I do want to see what it would look like with a little mock neck underneath it put a little undershirt underneath it and I think it looks so much better I feel like the extra large might have been a little too big I think I could have worked with the large and that's only because I didn't realize that it's gonna be a cropped t-shirt because with a crop t-shirt I feel like it's a lot more wider where if it's like a longer one they go further down so I think a large actually would have worked again because it is a woman's shirt I tend to not like how they fit because they're just a little too tight in the wrong places but I also think that the large might have fit me a little bit better with this neckline see I think that this would look so cute underneath a cardigan so let me just go grab a cardigan all right I have two cardigans that I could pick I could go with this cat one or this golfing one I think the golfing one also both of these are vintage northern reflections this is how I would wear it a hundred percent this I like it with the cardigan. I think it looks really cute with the little the layer. This is how I feel like I would wear this t-shirt. Okay, next up. All right, we have this nice mock neck sweater. Okay, y'all know how much I love my mock neck sweaters. I'm obsessed with mock neck sweaters. Really like this. I don't have it in red. I have it in like every other color, <laughs> but I don't have it in red. That's the great thing about Northern Reflections is that once you know your size, you're pretty much guaranteed to always like the fit of it. For these ones personally, I like them fitting a little bit looser like a baggy sweater. So I go with the extra large. I know I need to fit, but also I need it to fit my long arms. I mentioned this a lot. I have long arms and I need shirts to reach to the end of my arm. I'm really excited to wear this, especially for the holiday season. It's long enough to reach my hand, you know? I think this one's really cute. I really like the fit of it. It's so nice, it's soft. I do like the mock neck, and again, it is not too tight. It's not claustrophobic fits good nice feeling in the arms so this here i think would look really good with a vest of some kind i did actually thrift a vest i thrifted uh this one it's not northern reflections but i don't know if i have any northern reflections vests that's probably something i should uh get onto do you see the vision of the shirt i think it looks really cute holiday season coming up these cats have little bells by the way on them again i think it's gonna be good for like a layering piece which i could show you okay something like this right with winter jackets sometimes they get really really bulky like this one might not look like it but it's it's thick it's meant for outside it's probably a skiing jacket this is how i probably wear it in the winter time because it's like not thick enough that it's gonna over like I'm gonna get overheated but it's not like just a plain t-shirt so if I take my jacket off I'm not gonna be cold oh the next one 
is this one here and this is the blue version of the red one that I picked out again I did get it in an extra large because I just love the fit of it I also don't have anything in blue and I feel like blue looks good on me but I never really go out of my way to buy it so when I had the opportunity I'm like you know what let's go with a blue one let's see where this takes me maybe I'll get into wearing blue I mean I started wearing purple I, I think this is really nice so this one is the same as the red one so that's nice and I love these because they just fit so nice and especially with the colder weather I like wearing like a mock neck long sleeve shirt but then you know I'm in Canada thus I need to wear a jacket and sometimes wearing a sweater and a jacket is just too bulky and I don't like it and I feel like a kid you know in the 90s with like all the layers going up for Halloween and I don't I don't want to feel like that so with these I think it's perfect to like layer it like with a nice jacket on top and I can go with a heavier jacket and not feel claustrophobic or like like overheat basically. I'm quite surprised I like this one just because of the color. I don't gravitate towards blue, especially like a vibrant blue like this. What do y'all think? Do you think I look good in blue? I don't really buy blue a lot, but when I had the opportunity, I'm like, well, I want a red one for sure. Let's see how blue works. I think they have like a few other colors of this, but I already have like variations of them already in my wardrobe, but I didn't have a blue one. So I'm like, let's just go with blue and see how it goes. And apparently it goes okay. These are exactly what I thought they They'd be and they fit really nice. The next one, I don't even think you need to guess what it is because y'all pretty much already know what it is. The striped mock neck long sleeve shirt that I am obsessed with. And no, I don't have it in this color. I have it in so many colors. So many. I love it. Also did get this one in an extra large. Again, the extra large I like to have enough arm length for my arms, but also I don't like anything that is too form fitting to me. And so the extra large gives me a comfier, cozier fit. I'm excited for this one. You know what? I've never actually owned a brand new striped mock neck tee from Northern Reflections. All the ones I've gotten, I have thrifted. So it's so strange having a brand new one that no one else has ever worn besides myself. I do want to point out, look at this. It reaches all the way down to my hand. That's always amazing. These are my other two ones. This was, um, this one here was actually my very first one that my friend Olivia sent me, I think for my birthday. And it's what started my whole craze of these shirts in my wardrobe. So I, I first had this one and then I ended up thrifting this one. And I have this one. They're all, they're all different. So it's okay. The material is really soft. I really like it. Again, I love the mock neck. It's not claustrophobic. I knew this would fit me because I've clearly have bought other ones. Also like how I can roll up my sleeves. Sometimes with like long sleeve shirts, they're really tight here. So if you try to roll them up, it's uncomfortable. There's a lot of stretch in it. So I really like the fit of this. Yeah, I'm just adding it to my collection of striped mock necks. And the last two things in here is something that I've wanted for a really long time. It's these. And these are the mock neck dicky. What it is, is pretty much what I'm wearing right now. But this is like an undershirt type of shirt that uh, I got thrifted, but these are the actual ones and I've wanted these for so long. This, this is it. If you want the look of like an undershirt, but you don't want the long sleeves and the bulkiness, you get one of these bad boys. You don't have to worry about it being too hot. So it is actually a one size fits all because it's just for your neck. What I like about this is that there's nothing that goes underneath your sleeve. The one I'm currently wearing is like a crop top that's not actually meant to be wearing it how I am. I think it's like supposed to be worn as a top and I would never do that, but like it goes down to here and it goes underneath my arms and sometimes it's just uncomfortable. Whereas this will sit like right here. It almost reminds me of like a dentist bib. Did get it in a white and I got it in a black. Now I don't have a black one right now. So that's that I love that. So here it is the little collar. I'm wearing it underneath the orange. It goes to about here, which is nice. And I do like how lightweight it is. It's not too thick. It's not tight. It is a one size fit all. So there isn't like a bunch of different sizes. And I think if it's nice around my neck, also, what I love is that like there's nothing underneath here. Here's the thing. I don't like being consumed by clothes in the sense that I don't like having so many layers on myself that it's super bulky and just awkward. And I, and I don't like how it feels. Whereas this is just like, I 
don't even feel like I'm wearing something underneath this sweater. I feel like it's part of the sweater. Very comfortable. The black is the same. I'm really glad I got a black one and a white one because then I can like, you know, they'll, they'll match with all of my sweaters. And that's everything from the box, but I do want to point out that there's loons all over the box. This is a really nice box and I'm probably going to keep it and um, put some craft supplies in it. I'm the millennial that keeps every single box from every single thing I've ever bought in, okay? I still have my box from a laptop I bought in 2009. I do really want to thank Northern Reflections for reaching out to me and sending me these amazing clothes. I am just so grateful. Again, Northern Reflections has been my favorite brand for like longer than I can remember. The loons, it's comfortable, it's my style. They have good like regular basics, but then also, you know, when I go thrifting, I definitely look for those older ones. And one day I hope Northern Reflections will bring back the crazy grandma sweaters. They will take all my money because I will give them all my money because I want those sweaters. Anywho, that will do it for this video. If you're new to my channel, like sewing, thrifting, crafting, and of course, crocheting, why not hit the subscribe button? You can follow me on my Instagram and my TikTok and my Patreon. I think that's it. See y'all have a good day now.